At times I've seen rumbles with gangs and people getting killed. And I remember I was about seven years old. I would look out the window and watch, this, watch the, these rumbles go on. They would either fight because of, uh, for territory or if not territory, see who's over who, who's greater than who. In Harlem now, you'd need a weapon to survive. There was like 20 different gangs around this area. We had to learn how to distinguish what block belonged to who. Because you couldn't just walk down any block. There was so many gangs. We were all kids and we, and we became men, you know, young men <laughs> doing crazy stuff. We was banging, we was flying colors. Baby Sunrise, we was walking on the projects 20, 30 deep. We are the Sunrise, the mighty, mighty Sunrise. I started as a baby bachelor right there on 148th Street and uh, Brook Avenue. Got my first set of colors after getting jumped in. The colors was like your life. The colors were so important. It was like, you better not disrespect any gang colors or that could be an all out war. You had to have your balls in the right place, man. You had to fight. You had to be able to take two or three niggas at one time. I'm telling you, I lived that. If the Savage Skulls had beef, our brother Click was the Savage Nomads. So when all of us combine together to fight against another gang, you know what I'm saying? You know, you got hundreds. Apache line, Apache line is something that when somebody fucks up or wants to leave the gang, you have to walk to the middle of two sides of us. Around 20, 30 guys, and you gotta walk by. If you make it through, standing, you're out. If you don't, which you never make it through, you're in. Before there was a word or anything called hip hop, you had the boy culture in the gang culture, you had the girl culture in the gang culture. There wasn't too much positive stuff to look at in this neighborhood. So we took to what was right there in front of us, which was the gang bang. When we went brand into dancing, like I said, people wasn't pushing on the way no more. When break dancing came in, just like he said, man, it saved a lot of us. Stop because we was like young and we was getting into a lot of crazy nonsense. You know, but it happened. There's only a certain limit you could give. You can't be in it. Being ours or not our kid is a choice they make. 